Let's find the derivative of this function. So we could use the chain rule. However, it might be quicker to use logarithmic differentiation. So let's try that. Let's take the natural log of this entire equation. All right, now we can bring this exponent to the front of the logarithm. Okay, now let's take the derivative of the entire equation with respect to x. The derivative of the natural log of y is 1 over y, y prime. Okay, here we need to use the product rule. So the derivative of the first is 1 over x times the second, plus the derivative of the second is 1 over sine of x times the derivative of sine of x, which is cosine of x, times the first. Now let's multiply this entire equation by y. Now let's substitute the original equation for y. And that's the derivative.